commanded us to be baptized. This is not holy water, but these are holy people going into water because of the blood of our Savior. So tonight, what we will do is we will come and we will enter this water in identifying with his life, his death, his burial, and his resurrection. And we will come out and we will live lives for him. Now, we want to give you the opportunity to not be that lost sheep that misses the incredible thing that happened in Bethlehem. Tonight, if you have put your faith in Christ, if you have believed it in Him, we want to give you the opportunity to join in this most ancient and wonderful symbols, like a wedding ring, a symbol of our relationship, of being baptized. So we have about 30 people that have already joined us here and have gone through a class and are prepared for baptism. But if you have put your faith in Christ tonight or this year and you would like to join them, then come and see Margaret or Benji here. They would love to talk with you. We have robes in the back. So as you see those people coming out, they're not monks. They're people who have joined us here tonight. And we would love for you to join us. If you want to pray with someone, still continue to go to these areas where the chairs are. Now, for this first person that I'm baptizing, JT, come here, buddy. JT always sits in the front row at Sunday school and answers all the questions. <laughs> does that because of the incredible relationship that he has. So JT, let me just ask you, tell me why you want to be baptized here tonight. I accepted Jesus as my Savior, but I wanted to become more in a relationship with him. Like you said, I wanted, he has visited as a symbol. I wanted, I wanted to make a symbol for me that he's actually with me and always with me. All right, Jonathan Taylor. acknowledgement of your relationship with Christ and identifying with the life, death, burial, and resurrection of our Lord and Savior, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit.